Namaste. My name is Will Zimra. I'm an international meditation master. Today I want to speak how to get the sex as you want it. When we can't communicate about the things what we want, we can't get them. And that has found out Zava, and Zava is a medical online service in America, and they asked about 1,000 couples in the USA and Europe. And they found out that 54% the sex improves when the couple is speaking openly about sex, regardless how much was a sexual, sexual satisfaction, was it low or high, in any case, so communication, the sex improved and that 54%. And that is totally amazing. So, and then they found out why the partner don't like or choose not to speak about their sex. The first reason is they are scared to hurt their partner when they talk about their sexual desires. Oh. And they <laughs> embarrassed to speak about sex. Who wonders? <laughs> Okay, this is quite simple. No? Then the communication in our relationship is not good. Or the sex is also down. Then our relationship is BS. In any case, we have to communicate for a good relationship over all of our problems. And if you can't, relationship is BS. It's very simple in any case. So this means if you are scared to speak about our desires, that we don't trust our partner. And with, this, with our body, we want to be together our whole life. Okay, then you say maybe sex is not so important. Okay. Imagine you have sex with your wife, and your wife is pretending always an orgasm and never got one from you. And after some years, she stopped to have sex with you. Who wonders? Both of you have missed the chance to bond together through great sex. If you have spoken over sexual problems, you're, you're Bondage would be much better and also your love because you have all the time in your mind how great it was when you have loved each other, which awesome experience you had, and so on. What is if your partner has some special positions? what he loved to do in sex, and they don't know it. You never can satisfy him. 
You see, everybody is curious. Everybody wants to try out something new. And this guy is scared, or maybe then he's going to a sex worker. Not a good idea. And everybody is different. When I went to South America, I was wondering. The sex life was totally, totally different. The females loved the position from backwards so that they don't face upwards or that they don't face God. And even worse, they love to do it in the standing position. That was for me totally weird. See, is something wrong with that? <laughs> it is the tradition, tradition, and we have to accept it. The other thing is, what is if our partner loves to break some sexual taboos? and cannot communicate about this. Again, we can't sexual, um, satisfy our partner. Maybe it's not a big thing. At least the women should communicate about their sexual desires and how they want it so that they get the, their orgasm. Would be nice or not. And then I came across that the sexual desires are different from the males. For instance, seeing ports. The females love to see at first lesbian porn. Then gay porn, which means with two males together, and the third is teen porn. And for a man, it is the first is teen porn, the second is M I N F porn, something with mother and so on. Okay, and the third is mature, mature, or mature porn. Okay. I'm a very simple thing and have teen form. Okay, to see. Okay. What is about that we get the things what we want? How to communicate about this? The first is we should mention if our partner has done it great for us. So that our partner is going in the right direction. If we're scared to write about some sexual desires, we write it down maybe on notes, and then the partner can think about it without to get embarrassed, both of you. And the next thing is very simple. It's a tradition even in China <laughs> that the parents giving their kids a sex book about different positions. So get one. Read it together. So that you get in the right direction, that you get find out what the other love and what not. Then go visual and see pornos together. And the next thing is go slowly in the direction where you want. Because in the beginning, I want also to make it backwards in the doggy position. And how to do it in the doggy position. And after some time, so I went step by step in the direction, and asked and asked, and then it was okay. And it was even very satisfying for the girl. And then after I have done it, okay, <laughs> there's no attraction anymore because everybody loves something, what is hidden, what is forbidden, what is extraordinary. <laughs> everybody does that. So, so. 
Okay. Thank you that I could speak about that and bye.